So the Iowa is from the middle of the plains, the Midwest. Iowa, Kansas, Nebraska, Missouri River, all run through the middle of the United States. So my regalia is what I'm wearing. I'm not wearing a costume. And I'll start with my shoes. They're called moccasins. And they're fully beaded, as much as they would be beaded. Um, my leggings are fully beaded. And it took me five months to make the leggings. And there's a pattern on them. And the patterns take time to think out and pray about. When we're putting those beads down, it takes time to decide how you're gonna make your pattern because that pattern that you're wearing represents you. <clears throat> My dress is made of buckskin, three deers for this dress. And so that means there's a, front, a deer in the front, a deer in the back, and then a deer laying over the top. And then the otter wraps. These are my otter wraps. This was one otter. He was 55 inches. His head's at home, but I didn't, <laughs> he was offered up in a good way. <laughs> and so we wear these things to adorn our hair, to adorn, um, some of the men would wear them as well. They're a sign of prestige, a sign of, um, you know, uh, using that otter or using the animal skin to help us, help us in our prayers, help us in our daily walk. And then eagle feathers. Um, this is a eagle fan that I have, it's a wing from an immature bald eagle. So immature means he's like a teenager. And so it's a little shorter than a full adult. Um, the eagles, we believe the eagle is the most sacred bird to us and it flies the highest to creator taking our prayers. And then I'm also wearing an eagle feather, which is a tail feather of a golden eagle, a black and white. Again, it's our prayers to creator. These things are helping me. These are eagle feathers as well helping me in uh, my daily walk. To hold eagle feathers, you have to be tribally enrolled, a Native American. It's a federal offense to have eagle feathers without being Native American. And they do that because we use these feathers where they're very sacred to us. They're like a Bible to us, like a cross. They're very sacred in that way. We honor them.